<laughs> so, after yesterday's video, went back to my car and I came over here and I checked this over up here and I said, there's the enemy, enemy uh, anti-aircraft gun right there. I just stepped on my shoestring. Dang. Oh. Let's get the shoe tied quick. So we have the enemy anti-aircraft gun. So I have to look around these rocks a little better. Now to show you, I, I looked up underneath it and looks like uh animal lives under there. It's kind of just dirt. But I posted a picture on Forest Bend Fanatics of this uh, in the uh, equivalent artillery piece that would be uh, that the uh, Viet Cong would have used. Been shooting it Mr. Finn. So I gotta check under here. Good. And see, it looks like something gets cozy right underneath that tree branch there. But uh, as Forrest said, after they shot him down, his buddy came back and took him out. That's why the one gun is laying down like this, not sticking up in the air like the other one, which is probably broken off too uh, in its destruction. But we gotta look, because it was a place they would have dropped napalm or something. It, uh, could also be in a, a second blaze or something, but huh. so I'm going to go up around this side over here and check the. See, you leave your partner in the car. Get out and come over here and get the treasure. All right. <laughs> well, now I'm on top of it. It's a good sitting spot. But I got these hills over tops of these over here I want to check because I'm looking at the view from his drawing. His sitting spot could be over on the other bank, across from the guns. There could be other things looking like guns too, so. Continue on. These are animal trails, if anything. Deer, bears. Hmm. Hmm. I have to do this to get out and exercise. Otherwise, I sit at home, my blood pressure just drops and drops and drops. And <coughs> not healthy. That's healthy. Get out here. Huh. Oh, yeah, that's the other thing. Right here. <laughs> you can see how the hills come out and you see the snow up on the 
mountain up there. That's how close it's getting. But uh, each place these hills come out, there's an omega. Yeah, there's four of them. So you got, you know, four of them. You, you you turn the map upside down the other way, you got three of them or something, you know, because uh, it, it's just con continuous. Those are just continuous omegas down there. And this is the creek that I got the video of the fish jump, the trout jumping in. So that's a, a good thing. And here, this lone spruce tree. If you heard the story of the trees, it's a tree that wanted to be the biggest and prettiest tree in the forest. I think by, uh, Forrest is a little biased when he talks about his love for the forest. I think it's just because that's his name. <laughs> yeah, <shit. laughs> he is biased. See, now isn't that a beautiful little Christmas tree? Yeah, he could have come and planted one here too. They are spruce. This is a popular Christmas tree. That's natural. See the omega is starting here. The creek just snakes through here. But I want to walk along the top. Maybe I'll come back down along the creek. Yeah. And I noticed the other creek I checked yesterday, there's a uh, fourth creek, a, th a third creek that comes down the hill, runs into the one that comes from the blaze. I'd be falling down if I didn't have these sticks. I've got three of them. I need another six footer. Uh, the six footer's turned into a four footer. <laughs> so I don't have that big long selfie stick really. I only got a four foot one. Uh, you know, I keep an eye out for arrowheads too, but I haven't found one yet. Here's a little creek. Where is the gun? See, you see the gun from over there. Hmm. Those two dead ones, they should just cut them down so that they can start rotting and let these little ones have all the sunlight they need. 
There's the gun. Now you see, the gun is right there. So, the view from his drawing. And he was about level with it too, and that's about where we're at, so. Looking that way, it doesn't really work. But he's got a lot of things backwards in the poem. So, the picture could be backwards also, you know, so... Uh, the left side could be the right side, and the right side is the left side. Because, boy, he's got the warm water on the Pacific and the cold water on the Atlantic. And we're in the word, the wood. See, still, the best way to see the creek is to go walk in the creek. You want to do that on a day when you're not going to need that shoes that you walk in with for a few days. <laughs> well. Unless you got a dryer at home. You don't bring your home camping with you. Let's see. I do a lot of standing and looking because I'm trying to figure out where to look, where to look, where to go. Mm. Yeah. That's a, it looks like a seed up there, you know? I just climbed down the hill. Ha ha. I gotta go back up. Because that's just... A seed. And you can see the omegas. Comes around now, goes around here, goes around there. Goes Omegas or S curves, whatever you want to call them.
Yeah, yeah. You ain't getting too far with a paddle here either. Yeah, we gotta get up there and check that. <sighs> There's a lot of loose soil here. See, this uh, hill slides into the creek pretty quickly here. I'm looking in the creek. It looks like uh, the little beaver dam looks a little ponded up behind there. There's a little pool in there with the logs. I have to get up here earlier in the day. Here come in the summer. <laughs> I was here in the summer, but not this part of my area. Oh. Rust in there. See, I got the uh, pole stuck in the ground. That stopped my foot from sliding down the hill there. It's like a guy's head inside an alligator's mouth or something there, you know, getting swallowed.
<coughs> okay. Well, we're here. <laughs> now you, you see his nose, eye, eye, mouth, hair, and then the crocodile <laughs> here. Crocodile head, he's swallowing the guy. <laughs> now we're gonna go. these trees here a little bit and then down maybe in that Omega there well uh, you know he says in the wood <laughs> and there's this much wood <laughs> yeah yeah that, that's a real good hint <laughs> yeah You would have been better off saying, under the rock, there's fewer rocks. Oh, look at that tree. His days are over. Looks like he took lightning more than once. <laughs> Old Aspen. There's one. Phew, just laying down. It goes way back over there. Lots of dead trees. Oh. Whoa, hang on. Thank you, tree, even though you're dead. See, these aspens are all interconnected under the ground. And so, maybe this part of that, that system died. All the other trees just suck everything that's left in it out of it and use it themselves. And leave the, the part that's uh, injured. These is your megas. So you might get a view of it here, huh? Yeah.
Yeah, it is a good sized pond. That probably is a little beaver pond there. So below the home of the brown beaver. Okay, so you see here's the creek over here, straight out my right, and here it is over here, straight out my left. So this here is the Omega. And it goes around that Omega, and then the one over there. But it comes over here and it goes around another one, and it just keeps, uh, it's one after another. There's something square by the creek. Dark bronze is bronze-ish color too. I think I should go take a look. Nah, we'll go look anyhow. right there in the creek this side of the creek or maybe it's a little island in the middle of the creek at the tip of that there might just be the end of a log I don't know Almost fell on my ass. Yeah. Oh. You see uh, those rocks there? And you see where the waterfall comes right down the middle of it. It's got to have uh, be raining and stuff for that to happen. This is a soft, muddy. Grassy, grassy, and nothing. Hmm. Don't even see what I saw that I thought I saw. Might have been a uh, It's one of these rocks here or something. Certainly not the treasure, huh? Well, look at all the wood in the creek. Look at how clear that is. There he goes. See him right there? Whoop, there he goes. Splash. Hey, tr crowd, trout here. They trying to go over the top of the mountain. There they go. He, go, he went back up. These are small guys. These are little juveniles, right there. Three of them now, four of them. Whoop, down the creek they go. Then where do you think they're going? Think they're heading for Mexico? I think so. They're going back home to Mexico. <laughs> oh. You think fish know that uh, water flows downhill? <laughs> oh, look at all the wood, jeez. This really makes it hard. 
Holy smokes, that's a lot of wood up there. Looks like a... Whoop! Ah, uh, that's what... See, the snow sits on these in the winter and crushes them. Uh, look at all the wood! You know, and he might have mirrors on it, so you shine a flashlight to reflect back. But, uh, you got to be shining a flashlight from the right direction. And that mirror has to be angled correctly to get you back. A reflector would be different, but a mirror, you, you got to be precisely aligned to see the flash come back. Huh. Uh, uh. Well, let's see now. That's what we're going to do. dead aspen there. Got kind of straight and smooth that log is. Yeah. Look at all that wood. Hey. Ow. Twig stuck stabbed me in the ankle, man. Okay. Well I'm gonna uh sit here for few minutes to take a break and and have a little uh spiritual moment See, I kind of got here late in the day because I was feeling ill, felt nauseous and stuff, so I didn't go nowhere until four. At least that was an hour earlier than I got get to get get, get anywhere yesterday. But and I still forget to bring things. Like I was going to do my laundry on the way back. I forgot to bring that. But I'm going to need to uh, come up here and camp another week at least. That looks like a metal box there. Rotten, rusty. Right there. But it looks, I guess it's a rock. Red rock. Iron, anyhow. Huh? Well, let's see. Mm -hmm. Woo Get these sticks for some balance, man. We gotta check that beaver pond. Uh, 
Do this way. You need a a search party to look thoroughly. There's so much I walk past it. I don't know. Whoo! It's a big pile of deer pooper. Whoop. Here you go, the trout. One going up. Coming up! <laughs> There's a little pond right here. Pretty. around these trees yeah. it's hard to get through oh man ow this one's got me from behind what is it snagged on jeez ah had to kick it Way to cut through the trees. Well, I don't think forest went through here. <laughs> Them branches would have been snapped off already. <laughs> now. There it is. The pond. Ooh, look at them swimming in there. Where did you see the trout? Ha <laughs> ha. I don't think I have my waterproof cover. Not on the camera, not on my case, not in my pocket. Nope. I put the camera in there and let you see them swimming past. Not a very likely spot, huh? Whoop, there goes another trout. I'm surprised we don't see him coming up over the, uh, the little dam there. I'm gonna look in that pool below it. Yeah. I'll go four wheeling to get there. Slide. Yeah, uh, Joe, that rock is so square, but uh. it's a rock, right? Yeah. Yeah. 
Yep, that's a rock. See if any uh, fish try and go up that uh, waterfall there. Yep. That's a likely, this, you know, likely area because it's pretty here. But that's just a rock. Not the right size. I don't think it's even 10 inches. <laughs> Maybe eight. See here, there's water coming down the hill. Right here. There's a spring. Which is a fitness type of thing. You know, it's a cold spring. Going from the hot spring to the cold spring. Little pond back there. Watery hole. Huh. Well, let's get close. That's how rocks get in the creek. People and animals knock them in. <laughs> uh, do we see any uh, trout here? Or treasure? Trout or treasure? What do you have to give me, Creek? I'm here for the treasure. <laughs> Think it's in there? There's something in there. Rock. I find lots of rocks. Yeah, rocks aren't valuable. <laughs> Some are. <laughs> now we were up there looking in there. Come on, stick. I see straight edge. I want to look in my backpack, see if I got my waterproof door for my. I need. I don't have the. See, I put the finger in there. I need, need the one that's uh, covered, waterproof one. No, it's not in there. It's probably not in my bag then. I just saw it the other day. I thought I'd put it in my pocket. Yeah. 
checking the bottom of the bag because that's where it'd be. No. Oh. No, I don't have it. I don't have it. It's at home. Good price for it. But. Uh, what I can do, I can put it in here, and I just can't put the back of it in the water. You know? That'll work. Cellophane, I could just put it uh, through the clamp. Okay, we'll see how that does. Very carefully. <laughs> Stay whichever way it goes. I think that was uh, dangerous enough, but uh, I believe I got the uh, correct effect. <laughs> oh, let's see if we can just leave this on the pole and we'll walk with it on there. Huh? There. Go to that angle. in there anyhow. Now you see this is a strap. I put the GoPro through that strap. And then it's uh, soundless. Trout. Trout, trout. Trout or treasure. I'll take the treasure. <laughs> okay. Oh, I was getting cold. I think it's dark too. Ha! It's watery that way. Whoa! Steep this way. 
but we have to go this way. Look <clears throat> the colors in those rocks. Ah, we got to go up over the top here. Across the rocks. And you know, they find an arrowhead amongst a bunch of other rocks. It's like singling out the one that's... Woo! That shape. Now the others are... have just as interesting shapes. trout. Everywhere I go I see them trout. Perfectly square rock. No texture. Not thick enough. Big flat rock there, but then it's a little water when it gets to this end. Oh, it's, it's still the rock. It's a big flat table, bedrock. You know, <clears throat> something like this. Good sized piece of gold would you'd see it right on top sometimes. Thought I saw a big fish. Let <laughs> me fish that big bin here. Shadows. Shadow fish. see nothing. That was a squared rock, wasn't it? Huh. Huh. I know what I'm looking for. Five hundred cubic inches.
Those trout here, you coming? This big hole. Oh, look at him sitting down there. You see him? He's just hovering there. He's a brown trout. That ain't no rainbow. Two of them. There's a little tiny one down there. Well, the ones I see are only five, six inches. come up from behind him. <sighs> oh, that is thrown. These fallen trees make good bridges. <sighs> now let's get this stuff out of the way so we can see the view here. Come on, weed. There. Huh? Where is it? Up there in the wood, huh? Or in that wood? Huh. Okay. Oop, foot stuck. There's a little dry creek overflow. I hear thunder coming. Rumble, rumble, rumble. We got the moons up. <clears throat> oh, we gotta get through this. This thing just uh, grows in the creek here. There's water in it. Oh. 
Whoa! Ow! Rock rolled up behind my leg. <laughs> huh. just like opened up right to you. Oh, that's this slide. Huh. Oh. Too long. It's all pretty. Woo, look, there's a little mall in there. Are they taking a shortcut coming out there? They all have, they got a little cave up in there or something. I went and hid in there. Huh. Oh. There's our guns. There goes big trout. There's his enemy guns. And he was sitting here. We gotta get down by the creek there. I wanna look in this culvert. That would be a real dumb place to put it. Uh, that's, I, I don't think forest would be dumb enough to put it in a culvert pipe. Because <laughs> the uh, 
Forest Service comes up here and checks them. Huh. So they don't have flooding and stuff like that. They gotta remain clear. So you put something in there. Put something in a culvert pipe. Yeah. It's gonna get removed. Uh, we still got the camera on. There's trout. Look at them all. Man, there's a whole bunch of them. There had been at least eight. There goes one down. There that one up. Another one down. Hop. Fishy, fishy. Show me the treasure. <laughs> There, you see right through that pipe. These suckers are tough, man. And they just want to scratch you up. Interesting area there, though. <laughs> See that pipe, it also acts as a sluice. So if you go clean all this gravel out that's laying along there, you're likely to find some gold. Maybe I'll do that next time. It's hard to catch it. Woo, that one a trout, man, right under my feet. Went right through the pipe. A pond on the other side, even. And I'm trying to get a good look and make sure it's not in there. Smaller rocks in there. Woo, drop my stick. Okay. Ah. Turn around, come right into a twig. Now get out of here. Huh. 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 
Oh, you see on that rock? F, F. Huh. The spongy log. That. It's a big rock. I don't know, I'm not seeing it. It's getting dark. It's getting. My fingers are freezing. 
saw the uh, FF on the rock here. Yeah, uh, that might mean something. But I gotta come and search all of these logs. This it's a uh, not an easy task to search a forest for a 10 inch square box. In the wood, under the wood, underwood. Huh? Well, I'll climb back up to the road here and then I shut it off. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah. So. Oh. Yeah, I wanted to. Ooh, yeah. That twig hit me in the eye, didn't it? Uh -huh. But, uh, I wanted to get a couple more. A few more looks before the snow. There's the enemy guns. Dang. So close. 